Now, there is one more issue that I wanted to point out here that I read into, which may explain uh, why there were so many people reporting uh, initially that the UC Tronics uh, LAN adapter did not work. Uh, now, as you can see here, um, it is connected and providing power uh, and data, by the way, to uh, my Wisecam version 3. Again, this is uh, courtesy of the uh, GitHub project uh, WISE WZ uh, Mini Hacks. Um, now, this uh, camera is also being powered uh, over internet. This is a PoE splitter, and this was the original um, configuration I had. Some of you may have seen my previous video uh, where I had to you know, string together a LAN adapter and then the splitter and then take the power and then bring it back in and then uh, this adapter had a uh, uh, Y cable uh, where you brought in, I could bring in the data from the splitter and then bring it back together here. <laughs> you know, it's like uh, uh, it's the scenic route basically to get to PoE. So, uh, but anyway, th this worked, but obviously this is preferable because you just have the, the one uh, LAN adapter and boom, you're good to go. However, and as you see, it's work this works and that works, okay? But I did run into a strange problem. Um, you would think that if all of this worked with this camera, all right, then this would work with the camera. So I just want to demonstrate the strange issue that I have ran into. So I'm not kidding. <clears throat> Disconnect the two here, and then plug uh, this. I always have a problem, you know, which side which uh, to plug in, but I think it's this one. All right, plug it in, and you see now as you can see here. Um, power internet right so we got power we got data coming over this uh even a connection but as you see here all right for some reason the camera itself is not recognizing the power no power light whatsoever um, i believe i would hear a little click inside but essentially no power now um I would imagine, I don't know what the situation is with this camera that makes it different from this camera, but this could explain why some people who purchased this adapter plugged it in and this is what they got. Zero. Nada. However, same adapter, right, plugged into a different camera. Plug it back in here, right, and boom, as you can see. I've got my red connection light. And again, the same camera, which would not work with this adapter, which clearly works, right? If I plug it into my little uh, conflagration here, you see, red light appears. And um, it will go to a blue light. And then, uh, you know, flash, 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 and basically uh, connect to uh, the WiseCam servers over my uh, Ethernet connection. Um, so, again, I'm not sure what the, uh, what the issue is here, but um, again, this is a problem I've ran into. Now, as you can see, this light's still blinking, and that light is still blinking. And usually what that means is I just have to disconnect and reconnect because uh, again it is the wise mini hacks wz mini hack uh, which is uh, taking uh, control um, of the uh, e of the ethernet connections so anyway but regardless as you can see here uh, we got I got power coming through the both through both of them but it does not happen uh, with some cameras and so that's the issue I would 
you know, like to explore and figure out 